morning, Hatchcat Friday Eagles. It is Wednesday, May 17th. It's day six of our specials rotation. At this time, please stand as some students from Miss Wilde's class introduce themselves and lead us in the pledge. Eli, Mason, Zachary, Angel, Yandi. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. You may be seated. We're back for another great day of teaching and learning today. I'm so excited about today. Yes. Big, today big day is a big, big day, day for fourth and fifth grade. They get to show everything that they learned this year, and I know that they are going to knock it out of the park. Yes. And you know what? It's, the, it's that grit we've been talking about. Yep. And it's that, it's that not giving up. It's that rechecking, redoing if need to be. It's that ignoring that giving up right there. Give it your all. Take yep. your time right there. Yep. yep. And um, you know if they're doing that with that positive mindset, that believing like, that you can do I it, I can do it and yep. will do it. Yep. So yep. double checking that you're at that yep. top of that steps right there. That I can do it. I will do it with that grit. And you know what? You'll find success. Success. Right. That's how. Success. Right there. That's so, it. Right. And okay. um, you know what? A third grade showed some grit. Too, yes, they so. did. Third grade scores kind yep. of came in, and they look amazing. I'm so excited. And so proud of all the hard work that our teachers, our staff, and our students are putting in this year. So yep. yeah, nothing can stop Patrick Caffrata. Everyone working together. That's right. So, awesome. Yep. All right. Speaking about working together, this person's working together to get one more year older. So happy birthday to Jason Pierre in grade three. So happy birthday. Dude. Have a great day, Jason. And then, guys, what's for lunch today? For today, we will have milk assorted fruit tossed salad and manager's choice manager's choice will include chicken sandwiches instead of a chicken sandwich you may have a yogurt power pack all right i'm very excited about the chicken, chicken sandwich. sandwich i hear it's got a little chick-fil-a feel to it yeah though, so. very nice I'm a you know, if we can get Miss Heather to get some Chick-fil-A yeah, sauce, I'll put it over the top, there, yeah. you know? <laughs> All right, and it's Wednesday, so you know what that means. Let's go to the lab. Ken, take us to the lab. All right, you got to listen carefully to this one. If you know the answer to this question, please dial so extension 215, 215. So it says, every spring, up to 500,000 monarch butterflies migrate from areas like central Mexico and Florida to the northern United States and Canada. Unfortunately, many only live two weeks, although some up to six weeks. If the journey takes two months, how do they do it? Oh. Okay? Okay. This, it's, almost like a, it's like almost like a riddle, right? Yes, but is. they migrate up, right? Okay. And the journey can take, um, the journey can take two months. Two months. Two months. But some of they them only, only live, live like two. a couple weeks. Okay. So how do they do it? If you know the answer, please dial extension 215. 215. And the phone is quiet. Choice? There aren't really any, there's not really answer choices. It's just okay. like a question. Okay. So, so how is this possible? Let's see. You're on the air. Who's this? Good morning, this is Ms. Busso's class, and we think it's a multi-generational migration. What? Listen to that word! Multi-generational migration. That is correct. Amazing. So, that is correct. It is multi-generational. I love that word. So, no individual butterfly completes the entire round trip, okay? The distance and length of these journeys exceeds the normal lifespan of, their mo of the monarchs, and so the female monarchs lay eggs for the next generation during these migrations. So it's like the you know the grandparents make part of the trip, the parents so make part of the trip, the kids make part of the trip. It's a family effort. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Multi generational. Wow. Yeah. So that is amazing. Come, great job, Miss Bussos class. You've won a dress dress down day. Everybody else, thanks for thinking about it. And um, 
fourth and fifth grade, be amazing today. Show everything, you know, take your time, double check your answers, read thoroughly, um, right? Get yep. the best answer. The best go back and reread those That's right. you need to, yep. so yep. you have that time, so take it. That's right. Yep. All right, that's all for today. Be respectful, be responsible, be ready to learn. Show that grit. <laughs> Climb those stairs of success. And remember that what, my friends? Smiles are free. Smiles are free, so share one with a friend. Every Wednesday, show that grit today.